Trackpad issues are among the most commonly reported problems with the Steam Deck as of August 2025. If you're experiencing unresponsive trackpads, you're definitely not alone, and there are proven solutions. The Steam Deck uses dual capacitive trackpads with haptic feedback technology. This makes them significantly more complex than traditional laptop trackpads, which explains why they can experience unique issues. Capacitive trackpads work by detecting changes in electrical capacitance when your finger touches the surface. This sophisticated technology requires precise calibration, which is why trackpad issues can develop over time. Steam Deck users commonly experience four main types of trackpad issues. Complete unresponsiveness, where the trackpad doesn't register any input. Cursor drift, where the pointer moves without touching. Dead zones in certain areas. And inconsistent sensitivity with erratic responses. The primary solution for trackpad issues is to reset your input devices. This process recalibrates all input hardware and resolves approximately 70% of trackpad problems according to community reports. Here's the step-by-step -step process. First, open Settings from your Steam Deck's main menu. Then, navigate to System Settings, select Advanced Options, and finally choose Reset Input Devices. The input device reset works by recalibrating the trackpad sensors to their baseline values. This process clears accumulated calibration drift, resets haptic motor timing, and refreshes touch sensitivity across the entire trackpad surface. The input device reset successfully resolves trackpad issues in about 70% of cases. This makes it the first and most effective troubleshooting step to try. If the input device reset doesn't solve your trackpad problems, there are additional troubleshooting methods available. These include using SteamOS recovery mode for deeper calibration, cleaning the trackpad surface, or checking for system updates. Remember the key solution, navigate to settings, then System, then Advanced, and select Reset Input Devices. This simple process resolves the majority of Steam Deck trackpad issues and should be your first troubleshooting step. When basic trackpad resets don't solve the problem, advanced calibration methods can restore full functionality. We'll start with the most powerful option, SteamOS Recovery Mode Calibration. To access Recovery Mode, power off your Steam Deck completely. Then hold the volume down button and power button simultaneously during startup. Keep both buttons pressed until the recovery menu appears. The recovery mode screen provides several powerful options. Navigate to developer settings where you'll find comprehensive input calibration tools that can resolve deep firmware level trackpad issues. For even more precise control, desktop mode offers advanced trackpad configuration through KDE Plasma system settings. Switch to desktop mode and access the system settings to adjust sensitivity curves and configure dead zone parameters. Physical maintenance is equally important for trackpad longevity. Regular cleaning prevents debris buildup that can interfere with capacitive touch sensing. Always power down your device completely before cleaning. Understanding the trackpad's internal components helps explain why proper maintenance matters. The capacitive sensors and haptic motors require clean contact surfaces and precise calibration to function optimally. Preventive maintenance is the key to avoiding trackpad problems. Perform input device resets monthly, clean your device weekly if used heavily, and always keep SteamOS updated to the latest stable version. These advanced methods have proven highly effective. Recovery mode calibration resolves trackpad issues in over 70% of cases while proper maintenance prevents most problems from occurring in the first place. Remember these key points. Always power down before cleaning, use only 90% or higher isopropyl alcohol, and never skip preventive maintenance. These advanced techniques will keep your Steam Deck trackpads functioning perfectly for years to come.